Hello everyone, I hope you're all having a lovely day. So, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you on how to add image props inside of Vignan, which is actually really simple, actually. Um, it, is a little, it is going to be slightly different from VC Face, of course, but it should also be pretty simple. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to your props, uh, the props tab over here, basically. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and add a prop. And when you add a prop, you're going to look for the PNG uh, GIF files um, or GIF or GIF, whichever you pronounce it. The, the, the file that makes the things move around and such. Uh, it sh you should be able to have it where it should also work, basically. So let's say, for instance... Um, Let's save this one, this file, for instance, um, where basically it's my character, just uh, my live to email, just like whoa. <laughs> um, so you can be able to scale it, of course. Um, basically, so you can utilize this to scale, uh, to scale your images, basically. And of course, you could change it where it could be. Um, you could change it to be linked, either to your body or it could just be a part of your world, basically. Um, so let's say we're going to go ahead and put it over here. So yeah, so basically I can have it where it's just the, uh, like a GIF file is there. Um, and of course you could change the position, you could utilize the transform if you wish to uh, rotate it basically and such. But yeah, pretty much um, that's what you can do um, with the image props. So you can either do GIF or you can add a simple... Um, you can add, uh, let's say, for instance, uh, this image of me derping, let's say, just, just this example. Um, we can be able to have this, um, <laughs> we could just have this, and then we could, like, move it somewhere else in the world, basically, or it can be attached to my face. That works, too. Um, so we can just make the scale smaller. Uh, oh my god, it's up there. <laughs> Let me try moving it down. Ah, uh, there you go. <laughs> so you can have that basically, and that's pretty much how you can do image props. It's not like click and dragging, like um, like how you do it on VTube Studio and VC Face, but it still does the job though. And honestly, I do like the system, but again, it's up to you though. Um, but of course, you can pretty much just utilize the transform modes to do like the clicking dragging stuff basically and then of course if you want to hide it and such you can you know hide the image basically but yeah um but that's pretty much in a nutshell how you can add image props or gifs uh into vignan it's pretty simple you do not need the sdk for it. it's really easy of course if you want more advanced stuff then you might want to um like if you want something like spout capture and stuff, you probably might need to set up a plane mesh and you know spout receiver and such with the SDK, which this tutorial will not cover how to do that, but I just want to at least show you this is how you add custom images in Vignan. Very simple. So yeah, um, I hope you guys have a lovely day though, and do let me know if you have any other questions regarding Vignan or any other programs I cover in this channel. I'll leave my socials down below, and yeah, I hope you guys have a lovely day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye! I promise you, that's not me in that picture.